Oh my god, guess what? Ah! Oh my god, okay, so I'm editing my video, my 31 through 38 week pregnancy update. I just got off the phone with my husband and he leaves Japan today. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I literally, I'm in the same clothes that I had on earlier. Look, see, same purple shirt, same belly, same shorts. I was just telling y'all that God will work it out and y'all he's working it out I am about to like ball out in tears because y'all know I felt like he wasn't gonna make it and I just left it in God's hands and I don't want to cry but I am forever grateful like I am so super duper grateful because I was just telling y'all earlier today that I was just like it is what it is. If God sees fit that he comes, he comes. If he doesn't, he doesn't. Hi, you guys. <laughs> I'm very, very sleepy, but it's the next day. I'm officially 39 weeks pregnant. Oh, my gosh. My belly is getting bigger, I feel like. Anyway, remember yesterday I told you guys that my husband got a flight? Well, he did get a flight, and he missed his flight. So, here we are back at square one. I was really angry last night, like, how could you miss your freaking flight, you know? But now I'm just like, whatever. <laughs> but anyway, let me show you my boob. Here she is. She's so cute. <laughs> I'm talking about she's so cute and you can't even see anything but my belly. But <sighs> she's getting so big now that she's 39 weeks. For now, it's time to curl this hair and get us in the bed because the boys are already in the bed and I want to wake up early so toodles hi you guys it's a new day so I shouldn't have taken you guys with me to my doctor's appointment today but I really just was not in the mood anyway she checked me she said that I'm still two and a half three centimeters dilated and it's very 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 soft in there so yeah <laughs> I asked her should I be worried she said no but um, Shania, baby K's godmom, she said that because it's very soft in there, like I'm probably gonna escalate very quickly. And I did escalate very quickly with Daniel when I was pregnant with Daniel when it was time to deliver. Anyway, I'm talking too much. I just finished um, like doing my hair. Some of the pieces just did not come out the way I wanted them to. But I think it still came out cute. You guys probably saw that video before you guys saw this one. Anyway, I'm about to go out and take pictures because your girl hasn't looking bummy. And I want to take pictures before my little baby boo comes. So let me show you my outfit. Okay, don't mind the mess in the bathroom. I know it's a mess. But I have on this orange shirt. I have on these maternity shorts. And I'm basically going to take like the picture like with my shirt open like this. You know, super cute. I actually was hoping that I had like a red bag, but I don't even like the color red. So why would I even think I have a red bag? Like, come on, Destiny, do better. Hi, you guys. So, um, I'm making a poster because guess what? I'm 39 weeks in three days now, and my husband comes home today. I'm so excited. Uh, long story. Probably will never tell you the story, but anyway, he comes home today. And we need to be at the airport a little after 8 o'clock, but I wanted to make a sign. So, that's what I'm about to do. I got dressed. Y'all, <laughs> I don't really had nothing to wear, for real, for real. Um, it was slim pink is around here, so I had to find this pink dress that I've worn a million times already. But, child, whatever. I took my pink curls out because I had them in all day. And... Yeah, I have some shoes on. Anyway, let me make my sign. All right, y'all wanna see my sign? Yeah. <laughs> Welcome home, my 90 day fiance. <laughs> Like the word 90 or number? Fiance. You playing games. Alright, let's go to the airport. Hi, you 
I didn't see you yesterday and I didn't see you all day today. Yesterday we found a Mexican restaurant to go to because my husband is obsessed with Mexican. Obsessed. <laughs> What else did we do? Oh, we went to look for cards yesterday. And then today the boys got haircuts. Oh, because tomorrow is their first day of school. And I'm sad, but I'm excited. What else did we do today? Mm, we went to Wingstop. Oh, yeah. We went to Wingstop. And that was about it. It's later in the evening now. Oh, I'm still pregnant, you know, obviously. Still bumping around. Only one more week later. <laughs> Still bumping around. I'm about to get their book bags and stuff together so that we can be ready for school tomorrow. I'm excited, but I'm, whew, I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm about to get their book bags prepared so that we can be ready in the morning. I have these shirts. I bought these shirts way before we went to um the children's place. If you guys haven't seen our back to school haul, you guys should check it out. But let me show you the shirts for tomorrow. Oh yeah. And make sure to like down, like down, comment down. The, how do you say it? <laughs> comment down below. Comment down below in this video. And if you like it, then you get to see my lunchbox again. Alright, so this is Daniel's. It says first day of second grade. I got this from Children's Place like a long time ago. And then this one says first day of third grade. First day of third grade. I'm in third. I'm so sad. But I'm excited. Like, I'm excited too. So, anyway, I want to wear my shirts for tomorrow. And I'm going to get them prepared. So. Hey, wait. Anyway, bye y'all. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Hold on. Like, like and subscribe. <laughs> All right. I am 39 weeks in four days, I think, maybe. I don't know. And my boyfriend is finally my here. My fiance. 90 day fiance. Fresh out. Fresh out. Off probation. Parole. Uh, we're going to my doctor's appointment to get checked and stuff. So let's go. So she just checked me. I'm still like two and a half centimeters and it's very mushy down there. That's the same thing she said last week. But now I have to be put on the monitor because um, baby isn't like moving as much as she used to. That's what I've observed. I've observed for like the last week or more that she hasn't been moving as much as she used to. So I have to be put on the monitor for 15 minutes. Okay. 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 Oh, this is so uncomfortable. Okay, everything is good with my boo thing. She's fine. They said I passed the NST. I don't even know what the test was called, but they said I passed and they said they didn't pick up any contractions, which was very odd because I know I was having contractions while I was on that monitor, but they didn't pick up any contractions. I was late taking the kids to the bus stop this morning, so I had to like run to the bus stop. So now I have like a lot of pressure in my vaginal area like it hurts so that's that but yeah outside of that i don't know nothing really <laughs> i'm tired um i just want to get some good sleep and i'm ready for this baby to come honestly i'm really excited um i'm a little nervous but i'm more excited than anything else so We'll see when she's ready to come, but for now, we're still waiting. Yesterday was my official due date and no sign of homegirl. <laughs> I took the kids to school yesterday morning and they were like, so when we get off the school bus, that means our baby sister's going to be here. And I was like, I don't know, we'll see. So we ran errands all day. I walked all day. And then when we got back home it was time to get them from the bus stop and they were like 
oh man, my sister's not here yet. <laughs> so they're really excited about having a sister, but no sign of homegirl. Not one sign at all. Yeah, hopefully this is like the last belly shot because I'm tired. <laughs> Being pregnant is exhausting. Anyway, hopefully she comes any day now <laughs> because I'm 40 weeks. Toodles. Good morning. Guess what? Still pregnant. <laughs> Looking a mess. But today is my 40 week appointment. I'm technically, let's see, 40 weeks in three days now. And there's no sign. No sign of Little Miss Thing. So, we have an appointment at 10 o'clock at 7.43. I'm trying to get these kids off to school because they gotta go. Oh my God, if you guys watch my straightening my hair video, this is the aftermath. <laughs> it's been like a week and this is what my hair looks like. It still smells good. <laughs> yeah, but um, it actually smells like cinnamon. It smells like cinnamon. I don't know, but she's giving Diana Ross. She's giving Tracy Ellis Ross. She's giving, <laughs> but she's still a mess. I'm going to finish eating my Frosted Flakes because these things is bomb.com. And then I'll see you guys when it's time to go to my doctor's appointment. Oh, by the way, my mom is here. I forgot to mention that. My mom got here two days ago. So she's here to help with baby K, but... Baby K acting like she don't want to come, so whatever. We're gonna have a baby hopefully in a few hours. How do you feel? I feel the same because you ain't, you ain't dropping a day. <laughs> you don't think I'm gonna have her today? So. It's been three days since her due date. Mm -hmm. So, nothing. Nothing what? You don't think she's gonna come today? I don't know when she's gonna come. Who's gonna come? Who's ready to come? Fine. Mm. Um, Probably just didn't think to ask you. <laughs> Probably my most of the time, most moms will request it if they really want it. But I think it's a good idea because I know you're trying to avoid um, induction. Yes. They don't let you go past 41 weeks one day. Oh, really? Which would be unusual, but you know, that's post dates. Mm hmm. So we, I'd have to call over and hopefully you won't need that date because of the stripping. Yeah. Oh, lots and lots of pressure. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't do it like that, Destiny. You can't be that uncomfortable. We're right. laughing. I know. What'd I say? Breathe? Yes. Am I breathing? Yes, you are breathing. <laughs> breathe. Alright. You are probably closer to three. I did a sort of fake, uh, minor sweep. Mm, that's not a so usually we go in and then we separate the bags like this so mm -hmm. wasn't able to get fully in there but right here I did mm -hmm. and usually what that stretch will do is irritate enough for those prostaglandins to start secreting mm -hmm. and that's what produces those cramps mm -hmm. is my mucus plug out yet I didn't feel a mucus plug you didn't feel it or see it come out I've never no nothing it's like no so if you don't want to do an induction for 41 weeks one day hopefully we won't need it then I will have to have you come back twice that week for NSTs. So. No, yeah. don't put me on nobody's schedule. What are you gonna do? What you, what you waiting for? I know what you I'll gonna do. You wanna be out and be out? Yeah, come on. What you waiting for? You got your support team here, stop it. You being crazy All right, for no reason. Okay. you think about it. I know it's a lot to take in because we're trying to avoid it. Yeah. So call us so by what are you trying to avoid? The inducing? All of it. Well, I mean, you gotta do you gotta do something just in case you don't come so you'll be there you'll be right. in place because the, the problem is too if you wait and then you yeah. decide well later you don't have a spot and, and there's no spot sometimes we've had moms go to 42. yeah after leaving the doctor's office i had a really difficult decision to make was i going to be induced or was i going to try to get this baby out naturally so my husband and my mother and i all went out for pedicures child that massage chair had me feeling some kind of way i could sit there for 
hours. Anyway, a few days went by and I was still pregnant. I didn't know what to do. So I resorted to doing a lot of walking. Um, I found these really cool steps to walk up. So we walked the steps three times and still nothing. No contractions whatsoever. It left me feeling frustrated and still very anxious because I didn't want to be induced. Uh, I've never been induced before. And I just thought that, you know, she would come when she's ready. However, it was a really difficult decision for me to make because I felt like I wasn't in control. With that being said, a few days went by and it was actually time to give birth to my little baby. 7-11 in the morning. I'm bleeding. Huh? I'm bleeding. You're bleeding? Yes. Come on. Uh, 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 